Welcome to Trans Turn Dance, the channel for feeling good through nature and animals, travel, cross-culturality and the contemplation of beauty. I'm G. I've been a well-being consultant and traveler for 20 years and today I'm taking you far away. The video you're about to view is part of a three-month odyssey from Independence Day in Los Angeles to Full Moon Wolves in Yellowstone National Park. You can take it as a one-off trip or you can go all the way, hit the road with me and my team. This will be across amazing cities and landscapes of the Wild West. Every step of the way, I'll give you a taste of the place, its people, its ambience, and I'll offer you a guided reverie or daydream, a deep relaxation or meditation with stunning sounds and images. Before you take off, remember to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified of the next video on offer. Now, are you ready to fly away with me? Whoosh. Well, did you enjoy our Monterey jellyfish trip and our mermaid meditative moves on music in episode 2? Because you're in for discoveries of a different kind in this episode. Here we are, mythical San Francisco is at our feet. An inspiration to free thinkers and free lovers. If you're going to San Francisco, be sure to wear some flowers in your hair. I sit and watch the bay in all its shades of grey, but in my mind's eye, I travel down memory lane. I see fields of green and flowers and colours, shiny, happy people holding hands. In this very place, the very year of my birth, the summer of love happened where a hundred thousand flower children flocked to celebrate peace and love. They brought the world an exhilarating feeling of joy and free-flying spirits and wild dancing bodies. They called it the Gathering of Tribes, a human be-in. Hey, hey, my trans dance tribe, fancy being here? What will we find downtown? Let's take a pick and hit the road. We're in for a shock. Where have the happy hippies gone? Desolation, deprivation, drugs, crime, urban overpopulation, the clash of deep poverty and big money. But never mind the dark side, we're in to have a good time. What would you do? Go away or play perfect tourist? We go for option two. And now we're in for truly lovely surprises. We find that in San Francisco, you can have the best nightlife, dancing and art life if you have friends to take you places. So now, come and play tourist with us and take a snapshot tour of the best things to do. First, we set off with the classics of the classics. A city tour on the tram. I hate being in big metal boxes, but to please my cool travellers, I step in. Freaky scary! But no regrets. Si le tram passe ici, la voiture pourra passer.
we go from the mixed feeling of landing on another planet in Chinatown to the feeling of riding through a strangely familiar place. Something you know from, well, Is it déjà vu or from those countless film scenes you've seen before? Here is world famous and incredibly impressive Russian Hill. Twin Peaks Road, Pier 45, and of course, infamous Alcatraz. Being a tourist here is like being Little Red Riding Hood, straying from the path, jumping from one attraction to the next. So, what is next now? As you know from our videos on well-being through housing, I'm an art and architecture fan. And this city spoils me with ideas, left, right and centre. There are design masterpieces, amazing street art for photo shoots. But even that is not the most pleasant surprise. The best surprise is Unlike all those big cities where you find only the same, same boring brands and the same, same uniform clothing style on Main Street, here you will discover clothes and home decoration items inspired by the full range of indie styles, whether psychedelic visions, rainbow movement, punk and cyberpunk. Whoa! I even throw away for one day my anti-consumption mentality and binge buy to bring home souvenirs and presents that will keep us going for years. And now we've earned it. Bobo's Unbelievable Cuisine. A restaurant like you've never seen before. Food like you've never tasted before to end the night with dancing and clubbing and karaoke, which we did not film and will leave entirely to your imagination. Right then, if you're a nature lover, there's only so much time you can bear to spend in city stress. Talking about bears, now let's move on to why we really are in California magnificent Yosemite and Sequoia National Parks. Follow us there in the next episodes. And in the meantime, please remember to show us your appreciation with a like, a comment and, most importantly, a share. Bye-bye!